Fate of ammonia. What is this fate of ammonia? Actually, after ammonification step in the nitrogen cycle, the ammonia is there. Yes, how it is going to, uh, to the next step and it is converting into the other forms or the organic forms or the organisms they will absorb and how they will utilize. Let us see. Okay, this ammonia at the physiological pH. Okay, physiological pH, this ammonia will be protonated. Protonated means the H plus ion will be added. Okay, it will become the ammonium which is harmful to the organisms, plants as well as other things. So, these ammonium ions are harmful, these are toxic to the plants. Hence, uh, this does not, uh, cannot be accumulated in the plants. So, what they will do? This ammonium will be used to synthesize the amino acids in the plants. Okay, to synthesize ammonia, ammonia, amino acids in the plants. Okay, so this ammonium to the amino acid conversion step, it involves the two steps. Huh? First one is the reductive amination. Okay, reductive amination is first step. In this process, what happens? The reduction step dehydrogenation will take place. Reduction is nothing but the dehydrogenation, right? So, in this process, the ammonium or the ammonia, it will react with the alpha ketoglutaric acid. So, this alpha ketoglutaric acid will act as a, a precursor to synthesize the amino acid. So, these two will bind together and they will form an amino acid that is glutamic acid. So, this is the first amino acid which will be synthesized. Okay, glutamic acid is formed in the presence of dehydrogenase enzyme because this is a reduc reduction step. Yes, dehydrogenase enzyme will participate and it will perform the reaction, reductive amination reaction. Okay, and the second step is transamination. Okay, what happens in the transamination? The transfer will take place. Transfer of what? Amination, right? That is amino group will be transferred. So, this is the first amino acid, glutamic acid. So, this glutamic acid will transfer the amino group which is present in that. It is amino acid. It contains the amino group, right? So, that will be transferred to the next any organic acid to synthesize the amino acid okay this is the first amino acid and it will transfer the amino group to the next one to the organic acid so it will become a amino acid so this will be the donor and this is the acceptor final amino acid will be synthesized in the presence of trans aminase enzyme in the presence of trans aminase enzyme the complete reaction will takes place like this the synthesis of the amino acids will takes place. Okay, thank you.